All right, yes then the people. This is a this is a very interesting intro to the video. I'm not used to not used, usually you see me around concrete and that. But yeah, we're we're here today. We're gonna do what how'd you say it? Merthyr Merthyr Tidville. Merthyr Tidville, I'll get it. Oi! Had to duck that branch. Merthyr Tidville, I don't know. We're gonna have to We don't know how to pronounce it. We're not gonna be able to pronounce it. We, I don't know if we, we can't pronounce it, we can't find it, but Lord knows we're gonna try to order it one way or another. Um, yeah, let's just keep this rolling. Boy, do you reckon we should just try kind of duck through there? Is it down there? It's literally there, bro. We've definitely not come the right way, but if this, if this, ain't, if this ain't hostile reconnaissance, I don't know what is. <laughs> Man, I'm joking, I'm joking. <laughs> this is a covert operation, at least for the time being, but we're gonna. Oh, boy. Yeah, we can't get down there, bro. Nah? All right, we'll pick this back up. All right, so we, we made it through the um, through the nettles and stuff. And yeah, look, looks like we're here. So yeah, this is the spot where that Inspector Dean thought it was a good idea to come grip up um, young kids, young 16 year old kids, bully them, get them in a headlock, uh, arrest them under the Terrorist Act. I think it happened right here. What are you doing, eh? Why? Because I'm allowed. I know you're allowed, but I'm asking you why. You were an inspector, no? I mind who I am. I'm asking you who you are. What, what's going on? I'm filming. I know, but we've had a few people filming up here and we're getting a bit tired of it. What's your name? Why? Because I just asked you. So I suspect you as being a terrorist. I'll ask you again, what's your name? Do you suspect me of being a terrorist? The NPCC. Okay, what are you doing? I'm filming. Okay, All the the rest of the terrorism. No, Come on in. No, Come on. Hey, but... No, no. I've asked you tightly. Right here, so we're going to see if you can get me in a headlock today. If he's in plain clothes, going to see if he's going to be able to put me in a headlock. Yeah, see, see how they deal with two grown ass men coming and auditing in your bitch. So, yeah, we're going to have to go over some energy for this one, boys. So this one's going to have to be some energy today, I tell you. What's up? Where's that Inspector Dean? I don't know, mate. Yeah, you do, you do. Where is he? We, we need to speak to him. You don't mind us filming, do you? You've, you've, you've had people come and do this before, haven't you? Who, who is that Inspector? What's happened to him? Has he been suspended? What's I the don't deal? Know, but Can you not comment? We're from Aberdeer. I understand. So you're not we actually based in, here? We work in Aberdeer. We just all. Okay, all right. So are you yeah. familiar with like what, who we are and what we're here to do? Internet freaks, quote unquote. That, that's the that's the choice of words that your inspector yeah. used. Obviously, we don't have an issue with you guys, but yeah. we, I mean, we would like to hear some sort of comment or. Well, I can't give a comment, but I don't know anything. No. What do you think? Did, did you see the video? Did you see what went down? No, I haven't seen it. But no. no. Should have a look here, man. You got any idea what like, what we're here to do? Like what? Just audit it. Yeah. It? But do you know kind of? Uh, Not really. Explain why we've come here? Yeah, well, we've come here reactively today. Um, essentially, I'm, I'm a YouTuber. I'm, I'm probably the one that kind of, I don't, I don't want to say pioneered, but inspired probably the guy that came here, the young boy, 16 year old boy, he was filming. Right. Inspector thought it was a good idea to get him in a headlock whilst he was in plain clothes, arrest him right, okay. under the Terrorism Act. Okay. It wasn't even and the Terrorism Act, it didn't was actually it not? quote nothing. It didn't say yeah. Right, okay. <laughs> so we've come here kind of on a reactionary basis to try and kind of find out, ask a few questions, um, gauge the reaction to filming. Okay. But yeah. Obviously, if you don't have any comment to make, then well, that's yeah, absolutely fine. I, I, I we're not, you know, we're not here to cause trouble and stuff like that. Um, okay, where do the cars come in and out of? The cars? Yeah. The vans? Whatever vehicle. Van, car? Well, all around here, really. Okay. Um, all right. Yeah. Sorry, boys, I can't give you more than that. No, that's but, absolutely fine. No Take worries, care. No worries. Come, let's try the reception. Let's see if we can get a bit of clarity on the, on the situation. Obviously, they're going to be um, kind of preemptively prepared for any quote-unquote auditors. I wonder how long that's been in. 
Yeah. Hello, we're here looking for Inspector Dean something. Sorry? Inspector Dean? Inspector Dean? Dean something, yeah, I don't, I don't know his second name, but um, you know about the recent incident that happened here, I'd He's imagine. Not duty. Excuse me? He's not on duty. He's not on duty. What's happened with. Could you clar- give, a, give us a bit of clarity on the situation? What? It's not for me to clarify this. No? We are, we're members of the public, like, I feel like we do have a right to know. Can I make a Freedom of Information request or something? Go through the Freedom of Information Act. Right. And you can get that information via the South Wales Police website. Okay. Do you want that information? Yes, please. All right, Audit in Wales, we're here for you, man. Um, I said we'd come. It, it looks like they're going to... They're going to respect what we're doing. They're going to let us film. But um, we want a bit of clarity on the situation. Has he been suspended? Is he still active? I feel like as, as the public, we don't really feel comfortable with, um, with, with a tyrant like that kind of let loose on the streets, don't you think? gentleman at the custody desk, or not the, the front desk, sorry, is going to get us um, some information about how we can make a Freedom of Information Act. Hello, my friend. Yeah. You go through the South Coast Police website. Yeah. There's a section on there called requests. Okay, absolutely. And then there's information and. Sure. Could we not speak to somebody, um, like someone senior, a supervisor, a sergeant, or an inspector? I feel like this would be a very good moment. You know, we're two concerned members of the public. We're concerned with the behaviour of one of right. your colleagues here, and I feel like. As members of the public, we, you know, may or may not be owed. Well, if you want to take a seat, then I can see if I can find someone. Yeah, I feel like it would be a good sort of PR thing. You know, we're not here to hostile or antagonise anything yeah, like that. I'm going to say this. You can take a seat, but yeah. I can't guarantee a time scale out as to when somebody's going to be available to speak to you. Okay, but you're happy to kind of put those processes yeah, forward? Okay. I can't guarantee a time scale on when it's okay. like... Okay, you know, we're friendly. We're, we're, you know, we're not here yeah, for any trouble. Just, we just want a little bit of clarity on the situation. I feel like it would be a good <coughs> reassurance for yeah. South Wales Police. You can tell by my accent I've come a long way to come here. Yeah. Clarity, clarity what situation? Just, just a little bit of accountability for what, what's gone on and if, if there was any sort of reason for why he's doing it. Has he been disciplined? Well, obviously, obviously, like I say, it, wouldn't be, it would be remiss for somebody else to answer for. Sure, else. I understand. Okay. So but I feel like if, if he's not here to answer himself, I feel like from a PR perspective from New South Wales Police, it would be a good idea. Case, then if you are from the media, then we have the, re- the relevant PR yeah. processes to go through. Sure, sure. But obviously, you know, as two members of the public, you know, the police public, we're trying to improve relations between the police and the public. So if we could just have some sort of reassurances and a bit of clarity regarding the situation in itself, I feel like it would benefit both the police and the public. Thank you, sir. Okay, that's absolutely fine. I don't want to put pressure on it. Thank you. So yeah, as I've just explained to the, um, the gentleman at the, at the front desk, yeah, you know, there's a time and place for recording, you know, the back gate of the... Um, <coughs> the back gate of the Nick, this, that and the other, but I think more importantly, we want a little bit of accountability. We want um, an explanation or at least some form of um, explanation for, for what had happened, um, what the procedure will be moving forward. Uh, you know, as I mentioned earlier, I don't think it's, um, I don't think it's beneficial for the public or the police to have such people, such tyrants roaming the streets, um, taking the law into their own hands and kind of, um, doing as they please. I don't, I don't think that's that's beneficial for either p- the police's reputation or the safety of the public. So we're just here right now. We want to get a few answers, if possible. <laughs> we're not here to kick up a fuss. Um, I think the uh, the motive today is um, is a lot deeper than that. It's a lot is a lot greater than you know just um, you know than just kind of filming for the sake of filming and, t- and seeing the reactions of public photography. We want answers. So it's going to see what happens. Um, I can bet that no one will come out. Um, if they do, then obviously they've had ample opportunity. We've given them a chance to um, give us their reassurances. Any sort of statement would be appreciated, even if they can't talk on behalf of uh, that inspector that did commit those crimes. Any sort of kind of communication now between the public and police, I feel like would go <coughs> would go quite far 
in in improving relations and trying to put this um put that incident with auditing wells uh behind us um you know as a representative of the auditing community i feel like um yeah <laughs> i don't know yeah like, as i say as a member of the auditing community i feel like it would put us uh, a little bit more ease to have some sort of um explanation or otherwise so that's what that's the situation right now that's what we're waiting to see if we can get and yeah we'll, we'll pick this back up inevitably if we get any activity so yeah well, hello yes so um we're just coming um i'm a public representative so to speak i've just come today i've traveled a little distance we want a little bit of sort of clarity on the situation or any sort of information that you're able to give us i feel like as i mentioned in the video it would benefit public police relations if we could have some sort of comment from yourselves are you here to report anything specifically a crime a concern or no i'm well i'm a concerned member of the public that's concerned fine. about one of your colleagues and um so about, the about, the about the about about the obvious okay, incident fine. you go for 101 and speak to the relevant departments for that okay. Okay. do you, you not have any comment to make I mean, we're not here to I cause problems no, or anything Jamie, like that i know that i know that yeah. every officer is here we respond to incidents respond to calls are you are you a sergeant yeah okay sorry about this this isn't the place to be because obviously no, we can't. We can't be here. We can't. can't be here. And I'll stop you from being okay. here, but you can do whatever you like. Okay? But we've just come here seeking some sort of and that's reassurance because we're very concerned at the behaviour of one of your colleagues. I feel like, fine. as a you sergeant, can, that's fine. You can make a formal complaint. That's not a problem. All right? there's, there's mechanisms in place for that. All right? I understand there's mechanisms, but um, yeah. you know we have our own platform, and in terms of PR re relations for New South Wales, I feel like this would be a good opportunity for you to make any comment. Really busy, unfortunately, but it could take. It could take two seconds. Has the inspector been suspended? I have no idea. You no do idea. have it. You know. You know full well. Of course you do. Sir, you work here. He's based here. So we sir, just want. We're concerned members sir, of the public. Sir, you're very busy. I have no idea. Okay. I, I, I can promise you that. I have no Are you aware of the incident? Suspended. I'm aware. But have like you I seen said, the footage? There's mechanisms in place for this. So if we want to know, genuinely, you want to make a formal complaint. And I understand about these mechanisms, but these mechanisms aren't going to bring these things to light. Generally, do you understand? Generally, we're busy. I can't. I can't say any more to you, right? Like I said, there's, there's people to follow. If you want to follow, 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 ask for information, they'll tell you what they can and what they can't, okay? And that's it. Or put a report in online, asking everyone to make a formal complaint regarding the situation. Genuinely. Not a problem, okay? Genuinely. But unfortunately, you've got officers here responding to calls, and you've got officers here downstairs mm -hmm. who are dealing with prisoners, okay? Sorry, guys. I have to love you and leave you, right? But unfortunately, you're not going to have any officers coming up here speaking to you. Okay, we're, not, we're not here for that. We just wanted to speak to someone that yeah. could clarify the situation. So sorry, we have. I do apologize, but everyone's busy. Okay, look after yourself, okay? No, no. Okay, so as expected, <coughs> little to no accountability um, uh, from the police. That was to be expected. I'm surprised that someone even came out. Um, the same sort of generic robotic answer, you know, call 101, um, mechanisms in place. That's the new... Um, the new function that they want to roll with mechanisms in place to deal with these things but what he doesn't understand is obviously us coming here and um, kind of giving a platform for us to document what has gone on the reaction how members of the public feel about what's going on i feel like it would be a bit of a human touch for the sergeant just to explain yeah listen we're aware of what's happened this is what's going on i feel like that would have helped a lot but instead it's the same sort of robotic um, mundane um, scripted response really call 101 we've heard it all a million times this whole call 101 um call 101 sort of procedure is, is is just another mechanism as he likes to put it in order for them to escape accountability uh, accountability so that's what it seems like call 101 and um you know somewhere down the line it's just going to get lost and forgotten so yeah that's um one thing is for sure though is that they're all very 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 aware of they the are very aware they are very, very aware on edge after said situation, I would say, innit? There's... Hello? Not filming. No, no, we are going to film. In the private no, 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 I can film, I can film. Okay, okay, that's fine. Can you identify, please? Yeah. Would you, do you have any comments to make? Listen, we're not here no, for we trouble. Haven't. We haven't got any comments to make, but do you want to just film wherever you want in the private area, but this is, this is not where you should be. Would you mind so. identifying as well, please? Yeah, yeah, I will, but I, I would like you to identify. Okay, PC six six four two. If the public area, that's okay. I know we're aware of this because we know the videos. Yeah, again, speak. we're not here for any trouble. No, You're probably not. Um, we haven't said that. It's okay. probably not your job to come here and you know speak on no, behalf of our, someone else's things. Our cars are in the area. Yeah. Obviously, we're not going to film anyone's private cars. Yeah, well, these are all private cars. I can assure you, we're not here to film anyone's private cars. I feel that everyone else has been here previously. Yeah. 
bow down to your request for them not to build this area. Would you mind identifying, please? Yeah, but come, it's not good. Like, obviously, you, we've had a little bit of problems here. So if you could just kind of take the, take the decency, just to identify. I feel like people are gonna, a lot of people are gonna watch this. Okay, and what's your name? All right. No worries, it's fine. It's fine. It's cool. All right. Is this is this all is this all private property? Is it? Look, there's been numerous videos. Because if, it, cause if it's private property, I'll leave. Everyone knows where the public bit is. You I, I definitely don't. I was, I, I'm obviously not local, am I? You've watched the video, though. I you mean, I watched, I watched, the, I, I, I watched a minute of it. I got a bit cross and turned oh, off. Oh, loads of videos said exactly the same thing. This is the public bit. You know where the public bit is. This bit I here is, is the public myself, bit. You know. I definitely don't know. You don't because you watched the video. No, I haven't watched the whole video. I don't know where it's public. All right. Okay. So what would happen if, if we were to walk around the private bit? Okay, what, 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 what would happen? We're, not, we're definitely not going to film no one's private vehicle. I can tell you that. I can categorically tell you I will not film anyone's private I'm not interested in anyone's private vehicle. And if it so happens... Point of this, what we've come here to, today is to have a bit of reassurances about it. Has the inspector been suspended, that Inspector Dean? I have no idea. I feel like you would know. Is he not your colleague? Like? He's a boss. All right. Okay, fair enough. Listen, like I said, you're not the police PR representative. It's fine. I wouldn't expect you to have these answers, but. So this is. I don't know from the video. Stop saying that because I don't know. I honestly don't know. No, because you've said this and I've told you the same thing and you're saying I know. Act like. My personal opinion. I don't know why you would come here if you hadn't seen that video and hadn't watched. I've seen enough of the video. I wasn't here dissecting where's public, where's private. Do you understand? Okay. Every video starts the same way, telling people not to off the. To go off the private car park. Every video starts the same way. Okay, I, I'm I'm none the wiser to what's public, what's private. No, we see. Nah, that's not good. You know, I'm being honest with you, and you're you're trying to act as if I'm deliberately being ignorant. It's not good. It's a poor attitude. Like, sorry, come on. Like, I'm sorry. Oh, I don't sorry. Oh, for real, I don't. Know. Hey, bro, do we know where's public, where's private? Cause I don't know. No, this. She's saying that. I, she's saying that. I. She's. You're making up so I should preemptively know where's public, where's private. Anything has okay, that's absolutely fine. We're, okay, we're not so here. we can just film in, the, in this area. Please. Well, I don't know. I, for, I don't know where is public, where is private. She's she say, she's acting as if I should preemptively know. I don't preemptively know. I don't watch audit videos, bro. I am audit video. If this was private, there would be restricted public access. You wouldn't be able to enter here freely and just wander on. You don't do that to private places. Yeah, I don't know. But naturally, I don't really feel like we owe them any sort of courtesy after what happened. Like, our member of the public. Yeah. But listen, we don't want to make this look like a public versus police sort of um, thing. Like, you know, I don't want to deliberately go on the private car park just to kind of antagonise them and show them, you know, like it's not a tit for tat sort of thing. Like, this isn't this isn't the point of this. But I'm none the, I'm none the wiser just, to what's public, what's like private. At the same time as that, though, or the, the, it's quite clearly private usage. You know, what I mean, you can go and park your own car in here. No, but it's publicly accessible. Yeah. And so there is no there's no dispute in it. There's no debate yeah. in it. There's no getting funny about it at all the law is the law isn't it yeah come let, let's see they come out see if they try to put me in a headlock so you can have a, have a preference or whatever but your preferences aren't written into law unfortunately unfortunately and they're there trying to avoid all accountability as well i don't know how can you not know you know full well oh i don't know i don't know they've just been briefed to be said oh say that you don't know you know damn well you know damn well whether my man's still here or not don't give me that nonsense about I don't know, you know, and then she's trying to make out I, that I should know where's a public private. I don't flipping know, do I? I don't watch auditing videos. Like, it's just rude. Like she's she's saying she's making up as if I'm deliberately being ignorant. I'm not. But hey, if, if it's private, <laughs> yeah, let me shut the window. Can't concentrate. Listen, we haven't come here to be a nuisance. We just wanted answers. Like they still felt the need to come out and give directives and say, yo, you can't go there. You can't go there. She wouldn't identify and then. Poor attitude. It, it, maybe, maybe, maybe we were right to think that this place is. They're all a representation of that Inspector Dean. Maybe, maybe they are. Maybe they're not. I don't know. Um, you know that gentleman there. He, he seemed alright. You know the first guy we chat to. Again, but no, he was very 
very, very aware. He was so of course. For the situation that you weren't going to say, you weren't going to do. Yeah, but listen, they've all been briefed. They're all aware of the video and they all know what's happened regarding that inspector. They know, and they know that they're going to have more people come out. Yeah, they still felt the need, need to bark directives. Who cares if it's private or public? Do you know what I mean? Like, so what if it is private? And and what? What what, what could we? What could what could what could we? What could what can we possibly do here in this private car park? Just like, do you know what I'm trying to say. Criminals always want police number plates, apparently. Oh, come on, man! Come off it, man! Come off it, man! You think? Come on, man! Look at this though, RS3 Q3. Yeah, that is super nice. I don't know how they're affording these cars though. <laughs> nah, man. Well, you know he would have got a full pension, so you know he would have. He'll probably uh, retire on full pension. But anyway, guys, looking to wrap up the video quite soon. Um, didn't didn't get what we came here for. Uh, believe it or not, we you know we didn't just come here to film to see whether or not they respect our rights to film. We did come here, in fact, to see whether we could um, achieve a little bit of accountability regarding the situation with auditing Wells and Inspector Dean. We failed to achieve that. Um, I mean, I suppose it was to be expected, but. I play Snoopy in our camera, Abu Dhabi. No, you are in it. I am. Yeah. Right, well, I'm, 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 I'm reporting you in. You're reporting me, are you? Yeah, because I'm. Um, you've got a Christian right brother on camera. Is that right? Yeah, it is actually right, so I'm, I'm reporting you. Alright, you, you do that then. This guy looks like he needs a wash, boy. Yeah, so I'm reporting you, boss. We're at my commission on camera. Just don't film no kids. See, I can't even say anything. Say it, come here, I didn't hear you. Say it again. Have a wash, man. Have a wash, you crackhead. How about delete the video, bro? Yeah, I wish you would take a wash, but we don't we all, don't all get our way, do we? Like I just said, I wish not to be on camera. Yeah, I wish you would. I wish. I wish you would have a wash, but we can't all get yeah, what, what we wish for. Sorry. Sorry. Well, just leave it, man. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. You don't want to get into this. Um, are you live streaming as well? No, I'm not live streaming. Just go in, bro. <laughs> Ross. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know. I know the woman's coming out to speak to me. Oh, no. Oh, no, the woman's coming out to speak to me. Oh, God. Yeah, anyway, bro, this, this video has been a little bit, little bit roller coaster. Like, we, I was, talking about, I was talking about some PR stuff and some accountability and public police relations, and the next thing you know, I'm calling someone a crackhead. Like, I guess that's what you get with Coley Burks, man. You never know what's going to happen, man. You know what I mean? One minute we're dealing with feds, we're dealing with crackheads, we're dealing with this, that, the other. Yeah, it's all crazy, man. It's all crazy in the dunya, but... Action packed, boy. Action packed. Action packed. So they're about to they're, they're about to to school the Pinac, the Pinac president on public photography. Ooh, that's some alliteration for your head top. The Pinac president on public photography. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I'm the Pinac president, baby. What are they talking about? About I need your permission. The hell no, I don't. Knickers are getting in a twist right now. Knickers are getting twist up. Anyway, he should have. Anyway, anyway. I'm going to cut the recording. No, no, we can't. No, sorry. No, I will continue to film. Whoever oh, I'm I please. members of the public, but that's all I'm asking. I'm okay, all right. Because it, sometimes it's not a nice okay. place to be. Well, he's, he's um, on. proactively come out of his way to come in the, to the camera. He's filming it, but he's, it's just yeah. out of pure. Uh, Respect for people. Okay, that's well, all. If he feels that know, way, we're not going in there putting the camera in his face. We're stood here, and he said, "Oh, I best so not be on the camera." Well, doesn't he? Do you know okay. what I mean? It's not. Sometimes it's not a nice place for people to be coming. Yes, quite personal to them. Okay. That's all, boys. That's all. all. Right. If, if you see people, just make sure you avoid filming them. That's all. Yeah, I don't respect. Yeah. Boys. Is that is okay. that an, is that a directive or is that a request? I don't know. What you're not going to get a reaction from. I'm not. I just asked you a question. All right. We're not being asked. You can ask. You can ask. You can ask who you like. Be respectful and we asked you out of respect for a little bit of accountability on this situation and you said call 101 
but you realize how busy we are and you're dealing with stuff that yeah, involves but you're, you're, you're not that busy because you've just come out to, to request that I don't do something so no. you can't be Enjoy that busy evening, boys. All right, let's go back to um, solving crimes yeah? be safe make sure I'll be safe mate don't worry about it that mate yeah I've told you my concerns but you don't you don't you don't seem to want to make a comment like all right, that's absolutely fine. If Dean ain't about. Yeah, that's up. Yeah, <laughs> my man come out saying we're very busy. Yet you've got time to tell me not tell me politely not to continue doing a, a legal activity. Come on, man, shut up. Are you busy? You're not busy. You're in there twiddling thumbs. You're in there twiddling thumbs, doing nothing about we're very busy, man. Just kindly or out of respect. Respect. Where was the respect when my man got twist up? Sixteen-year-old kids getting put in headlocks and that. Where, where was the respect then? Respect. Respect. We've tr we tried that respectful route. I come in here respectful. Now you're talking about, oh, you're trying to get a reaction. Nah. I asked, man, is that a directive or a request? He's like, oh, oh, I know you're trying to provoke a reaction. Come out here then, mate. Dumb guy. Anyway, um, you know, we've declined his request. Listen, we're not here to film members of the public. If you're going to be a little, if you catch me near you and I'm filming and you happen to be in the shot, then you're in the shot. What do you want me to do? If you proactively come out of your way to tell me to not film you and approach the camera, then what do you think is going to happen? Like, you're going to be on camera. So let's, let's, let's use our brains, yeah? I know them, I know them crack pipes. It's probably eroded a lot of my man's brain cells, but let's, let's try and use our brains. If we, if we have any brain cells left, let's try and use them. If not, let's not walk in the, way, in the direction of the camera. Anyway, I'm just waffling now. Um, so yeah, probably gonna wrap this on one, <laughs> wrap this one up. Quite an eventful video, pretty funny little video to be honest. I've enjoyed it. Uh, jokes, Me and man, like justice. On. We've had fun. Out We've had here. fun. We've had fun. Um, like I said, we didn't set out what we wanted to achieve, but yeah, uh, maybe some interesting viewing for you, you guys. So yeah, please like, comment, share, subscribe. Follow my Instagram, Burks underscore two H. Follow, um, subscribe to Justice's channel, Hit Just up, underscore Tis. Oh, yeah, leave that there, man. F that man. <laughs> Actually, I'll pick it up. Pick it up. <laughs> Oh, there's a bin there. There's a, there's a bin there. There's a bin there. <laughs> Follow my Instagram, Burks underscore two H. Subscribe to Justice the channel, Just t uh, Just Space Tis. Yeah. So let's go and do that if we could, could guys. Like, comment, subscribe. And um, yeah, a couple police bikes. <laughs>